Well, hello and welcome back. I want to say thank you for clicking on the channel. This is Nate. I'm going to be your host for... I got a really good one for you today. So this one is called the Riverside. If all these trucks have quit going by. All right, now that all the trucks have gone by, once again, where was I at? Oh yeah, this is the Riverside. This is a 2,400 square foot home. That's the finished portion of the home. You get an extra 1,200 square foot up to 1,400 square foot if you go with the 12-12 roof pitch. The 9-12 roof pitch will give you roughly 1,200 square foot. So this is a 2,400 square foot three bedroom, two bath home. And y'all are probably wondering, okay, it sounds really good. Where can I find this home? I am at Homes by Vanderbilt. Yep, I made it here. I am in Sanford, in North Carolina. I want to say thank you for letting me come film the homes. Look at the side of that home. Isn't that a beautiful site? Homes by Vanderbilt only services the North Carolina area. And they got a lot of homes here. Not sure how well you can see all those in the background. That's the office. Design room over there. And then you got all these homes back over here too. So really nice front porch right here. So I mean, it's a good size front porch, I would. You have to guess is probably about six and a half. So as we come in, we've got this really nice entranceway right here with a coat closet. They got the electronic lock even included in this one. So, of course, that wasn't a very good shot of it, but it's an electronic lock made by Yale. So really nice living room. Love all those windows right there. Imagine yourself outside here. Great big patio off this sliding glass door going from end to end of the home. So I love the dining room area here. It's a great big dining room area. And then the kitchen. 
Nice big island. You got some glass doors over here. Great big pots and pans drawers. Now the cabinets they went with here is kind of an egg white um, color. So you can obviously change that color if you wanted to. Another nice stack of drawers next to your, your uh, stove here. <laughs> Really like the backsplash they went with here. And it does go to the bottom of your cupboards. Microwave is just about the perfect height over here. And under our stairs, we have a coat closet. Now, I didn't mention that in this home, we have a theater room. Yes. I was going to kind of use that on the outside as, yes, this is my home. I have found my home. Is as I'm walked through the home, I was looking at the home and I'm like, yep, I found my home. I there's nothing I would change in this home, honestly. Good sized bedroom and closet in here. And we just finished up in the kitchen. I came into the bedroom, and we can't forget. Of course, it doesn't show up very well, but yes, we have a pantry. Great big old pantry. Lots of shelving on both sides. Now, there is a light in here, so unless you're coming in here at night, so with that window, you don't ever need to use that light. Now, down to the rest of the rooms. We'll go to bedroom number two. Now, as you can see, that's a queen size bed in your guest bedrooms or kids bedrooms, just to give you an idea of how big they really are. Nice counter space in here. I love the big old drawers they used in here. And we got to say hello to Raiden. And we've got a great big shower tub combo. And we can't forget, oh yes, we got the water heater already. Now I don't think that in the package that this home is shown with, that these come with it, but if they do, that's an added bonus. 
but it gives you an idea of just how things are going to fit into the home. So you got your full size washer and dryer with your shelving up above. Room for a stand up freezer right there. In fact, the cabinet's even cut out just specifically for that. Nice corner cabinet over here. Sink with great big doors down below, so lots of storage space down below. Of course, the back door is covered by a rose bush. So now that we've got this end of the home done, we got to go to the other end of the home. When I say the other end of the home, should we go this way or this way? Okay, I'll go this way. So we're going to come into what would be your theater room. I call it the theater room because that's the first thing I thought of when I walked in here. And you got the wraparound couch, corner couch, whichever you want to call it. And I am just going to have a seat. All right. So what movie are we watching? We got work to do. <laughs> so you've got some shelving down below for your devices. Got a nice little shelf right there you can put some more on. That's probably where I'd end up having to put my receiver because it's definitely not going to fit in that small space. Now you can fit a pretty large TV in there. That one appears to be about a 50 inch TV based on the size of mine at home because mine's a 65. I had a 50 inch before, but I really like this stonework here. And now we got to go do the bedrooms and then we got a whole upstairs to do. This is getting to be a long video. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to have to cut some stuff out, I already know, because we've got this extra large master bedroom. And if you need closet space, you got closet space. Dual racks. You got a bench with a foot locker down below. And you got the single rack. You got a ton of space in here. And if you needed to, you could probably put yourself a small little bench in the middle there or something, a small dresser. And then we come to the master bathroom. Got the separate tub and tile shower. I know I walked right past the sinks. Trying to make this a little bit quicker, I will show you the sinks. Got the really nice glass inlay. You got the wand over there, separate faucets for each shower head. Your sinks. You got the dual sinks, the makeup area. You got two sets of drawers, one on each end. Really nice light fixtures up above you there. Here is that big garden soaker tub. And then, if that closet wasn't big enough, you got another one. <laughs> yeah, you got a whole nother great big closet. And that just shows, I didn't even realize this was in here until I was coming in to film the bathroom. Because I, when I did my walkthrough, I totally missed this. I saw the toilet right there and didn't even come around the corner. Oops. Nice surprise. But now we got to go upstairs.
Look at all this space. So I believe when I was looking at the floor plans with this 10-12 roof pitch, it adds another 1,400 square feet to the home. And you've got this whole other room right here. I mean, heck, this would be a perfect little kids room. And not to say little, because it's a good size area. We got a whole nother area on the back side of your stairs over here. So if you need four bedroom, that makes a good bedroom. You need another master bedroom. You know, your in-laws are living with you. Here you go. Great big area. And then you could add another bathroom up here, whatever else. I mean, possibilities are endless. So with that, you should be going down there and leaving me the endless ideas that you have for that upstairs. While you're there, hit the subscribe button. Make sure it's gray. Hit the notification bell. That way you get notified on Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday when I'm uploading videos. And I will see you in the next one. Do appreciate you watching. Have a great evening. All right, so we're just going to sit here in the theater room. We're going to, I'm going to do your outro right here. So this is, as you can see, an extra large home, 2,400 square foot with up to 1,400 square foot upstairs. Once again, this home is at Homes by Vanderbilt in North Carolina, Sanford area. They only service the North Carolina area, so keep all that kind of stuff in mind. Prices, they can vary over time, so extra freight charges. There could be extra delivery fees, extra city and county regulations. So a lot of things can affect the price they go up, they go down. As we know, prices vary over time. So keep all that stuff in mind at time of filming in October of 2022. This home base model is $268,000. This one is $383,000 as shown. Really nice size home. As I said, I think I found my home. If I was living in North Carolina and I was in the market for a home, I'm buying this one. This is my home. This theater room set it apart. Plus the upstairs. I can think of a lot of things to do with the upstairs. I'll see y'all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.